back to my channel um before I get started with this video I kind of just want to talk about you know why I've been slacking so much on my channel which I truly truly apologize for so much um I've had a lot of personal things going on some things I've been dealing with that have just kind of you know made it a little bit hard to be on my channel as much but I'm definitely getting back into it um things are going to change a lot I know I apologize for this last time but then you know, things just kept happening. I'm um, not going to get too personal, but um, I was also traveling. I was in Jamaica and New York, so that took up time as well. But um, yeah, definitely going to be working a lot more on my channel. I'm going to be uploading a lot more. No more like once a month video. Um, it was stressing me out to not be uploading as much as I should be. And um, but yeah, like I said, I just had a lot going on. It was making it very difficult for me to, you know, sit down and film for you guys. But um, definitely going to change that. So anyways, today I have for you um, a what's in my travel bag video. I've been traveling a lot lately and I've kind of, you know, been taking different things. My carry-on, you know, trying to fit as much stuff as possible because I haven't been going on too long of trips. So I don't like to check a bag if I'm not going on, you know, a super long trip. Um, because then you have to wait for your bag, you know, stuff like that. So I like to just bring, you know, something that can, I can stick in the overhead. And then I like to have, like, my bag under the seat, like my carry-on, to put um, basically everything that I can't fit in that bag so that I still, you know, can bring everything that I need. I also um, stick a lot of things in my carry-on that I'm too afraid to, you know, go crazy up in the overhead or if they like throw it around or anything like that. I don't want like my makeup to break or anything like that or my cameras. I like to have that with me at all times. So um yeah the bag that I've been using it's really heavy but um it's this Lily Pulitzer bag. Super cute um kind of like paisley all colorful. I love the gold detailing on the um straps and everything and it's really big and the straps are actually as skinny as they are they're actually really comfortable to like carry around the airport and stuff so um let's show you guys what I got in here um the first thing I have obviously is my wallet I don't want to put that in my bag just in case you know sometimes if we're on like a smaller plane or something they will just put our luggage underneath the plane if we can't fit in the overhead or like sometimes they overbook the flight you never know what's going to happen with the bag that's not with you all the time. So I don't want to stick anything valuable or anything that's not with me at all times. So I have my wallet. It's just my little Kate Spade pink wallet. It's got the little bow for the zipper. I love this wallet. Um, Next I have my GoPro. <laughs> um, I absolutely love this. I love the pink detailing on my selfie stick. I hate when people call it that, but... It's a GoPro stick. It's not a selfie stick. Um, but yeah, I love this. I got it off Amazon for like $17. So if I can find it again, I'll put the link in the description box for you guys. But yeah, I definitely need my GoPro with me because you never know when I'm going to want to take pictures or like I don't want this thrown around. It's expensive. So um, sorry guys, I keep sniffling too. Um, the other thing I have that I take everywhere with me is my planner. This is just like the little Kate Spade 2015 planner. I love this thing and I always need it with me, you know, just if I have any like certain ideas or like video ideas or, um, you know, something coming up that I'm thinking of at the moment or something happens on vacation, you know, that I need to write down. I like to have this with me at all times. Uh, the next thing I have is this little zip pouch. It's from Express. I just, I like to just throw this in there, you know, in case I don't carry this around like when I get to the hotel I can just grab this really quick and you know throw some money in it actually what's in here oh I have itch cream in here from Jamaica because the bugs there are crazy so that's still in there this is actually the stuff that's all in here is seriously from like my New York trip my Jamaica trip I haven't even touched it um the next thing I have is this little Kate Spade jewelry bag I just shove you know there's nothing in it right now because I took it out but I keep like my jewelry, my rings, bracelets, all that kind of stuff that I don't want to break um, in here. So, you know, just a cute little pouch to keep all that in. I also have, I always bring, I well, not always, but I have been bringing this palette with me. It's the Too Faced Everything Nice palette. 
because it usually has everything you need. Eyeshadow, blush, highlighter, bronzer, um, all of that. And I definitely don't want this to break in my overhead carry-on. So I always keep this with me. The next thing I have is just my makeup bags again. I don't want that to break. This little pouch is from Forever 21 and it's like $4. So um, it's kind of big and inconvenient to fit in my carry-on, but it's worth it to not have your makeup be broken. Um, next I have my sunglasses. Well, one pair of them. My cat eye ones. I love these. So cute. They were like $3 from Forever 21 and they're my favorite, but if these ever broke, I would cry, so I have to keep those with me. This is kind of random, but I have my brush in here that could probably go in my other bag, but whatever. Um, oh, boarding pass, I could probably take that out now. Um, my Juicy Couture sunglasses, I just keep these in here because, again, don't want them to break. That's pretty much everything that's in my carry-on. I just don't want to break. Um, let's see. I have some gum. Advil, never know when you're going to need that. Um, I have this little thing of pills. It's just like Excedrin, multivitamins, um, Advil, ibuprofen, pretty much anything you need for that. Um, a bunch of pens. I'm always the one that's like keeping all the pens because, you know, when you go out of country and stuff, you have to fill out like those little immigration cards and they never give you pens. They just expect you to pull a pen out of your armpit or something like I don't know, so I always have a million because I learned my lesson the hard way. I always had to, like, search for a pen, ask everyone around me. So now I bring my own. Um, what else do I have? Everything's so tangled. Um, oh, this is my GoPro charger. My headphones. <laughs> Everything's a mess. Uh, what else? Perfume. I brought this little thing. It's obviously on its way out, but just Michael Kors. I forget which one this is. It's the gold. The gold one smells so good. Um, I also have my little vlogging camera that I bring everywhere with me. And what else? But I think that's it. I don't really have that much that I thought I did. Oh, some bobby pins too. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it, guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video and it was a little bit entertaining and you get some ideas of what to bring on your carry-on. As long as you have like cute bag like this it's literally perfect you know you don't want anything that's gonna weigh you down or I heard the Louis Vuitton bags and stuff are even like really uncomfortable but um this is definitely like a decent price really cute bag so I love bringing this it's definitely my go-to these days for my carry-on so yeah I'll talk to you guys next time thank you so much for watching